All right. Hey everyone, Flint True Channel. Hope everyone's doing well, staying in the word. God bless you all. And like I said, I sincerely appreciate each and every one of you guys for checking out my videos and it does mean a lot to me. I'm gonna play this little clip right here of these little false clown devils. And of course they're exposing another false clown devil, devil Robert Breaker. Um, but it's really interesting what Brian Denlinger and them say right here. They point out Robert Breaker's um, tie having crucifixes on it. And uh, Brian says, oh, it's no coincidence that he's wearing a tie with crucifixes. Well, what about all the videos with Brian wearing ties with crucifixes? Or him putting the crucifix with the false Jesus on the back of his car? Yeah, it looks like he's got crucifixes on his um, tie. He does. He does. Yeah. No connection there, but... Uh... No connection there, Brian is going to say, like, he says it, like, obviously, like, condescending, like, saying, oh, there's no connection there, like, meaning there's a connection there, but when Brian wears his Masonic Knights Templar tie, oh, that doesn't mean nothing, it's just a cross and crown. It's like he's got crucifixes on his, um, tie. He does. He does. Yeah. No connection there, but, uh. You know, you're going to see here a little bit. I mean, he's he's building that crucifixes on his um, tie. He does. He does. Yeah. No connection there, but... Uh, <laughs> no connection there, but, uh, like, ridiculous. Now here, I'm going to show you a picture of Brian wearing the same thing. The man's just the biggest hypocrite ever. Oh, what is Brian wearing right here? A crucifix. The same exact thing that he just accused Robert Breaker of, that he's trying to expose Robert Breaker of, they all call him out. Oh, and he's wearing a crucifix. Brian Denlinger does the same thing, and this is looks like a Knights Templar um, cross at that. So this guy's just a devil, man. I mean, just a hypocrite, lying, hate-filled devil. And don't be fooled by him because it's a double whammy. Not only is he sending you to hell with this false gospel, but he's also taking your money uh, at the same time. So... Get this truth out there, guys. I appreciate each and every one of you, and God bless all of you.